Now Gallo on the overlap. The referee got out the way. Gallo stands it up. Cabal! And Alquist pushed away by Terracciano. Two big opportunities there for Lecce. Mohamed Kaba almost scoring his first goal for the club. Struck by Udan, it goes in. And that is a big goal for the struggling side, which is celebrating now. Terracciano didn't see it, he's furious. The wall didn't do its job. Somehow, it's gone between the space between Sotil and Bonaventura. Uta, lovely weight on the pass. Banders cut back. This is Kristovic, and still, they've hit the woodwork again. Lecce have now struck the bar and the post, as well as scoring. with the flick on, dealt with by Gallo, but straight to Mandragora, still Mandragora! What an impact! They brought Belotti off the bench to get the goal, but instead it's the other substitute, Rolando Mandragora with a bullet. Just five minutes into the second half, Fiorentina are level. Kristovic knew where Banda was, given away by Milenkovic, and Banda's too quick for him. Lavic Banda, again Tiracciano with the save. Oh, he needs to be careful, he's not. That is careless from Vladimir Falcone. He's played it straight against Beltran. Credit to the number nine for closing him down. Fiorentina have a gift of a second goal. Nico Gonzalez. Belotti, it's miscued and it almost went in. Belotti catches the bar. That was almost the third goal. Sansone with the free kick, Enzola up in the air, this is a chance, and they've got the equaliser. Roberto Piccoli in the 90th minute of the match, it's another substitute on the score sheet. Joan Gonzalez, this is Piccoli, and now it's Kristovic and Dogu! Two goals in a minute for Lecce. They have been craving. They've been desperate for victory. And it looks like their prayers have been answered. It's a massive win for Lecce. Full time at the Via del Mare. Lecce three, Fiorentina two.